Hey everyone, welcome back to another Patty's Lab video. This is a unprepared video and it's based on a question that I got regarding my uh, over-engineered cable uh, guide. And actually some people were asking, like I don't have the M3 tap that you need to uh, tap this hole with or the M3 set screw that you need to connect this dovetail to this other part right here. If you want to know what this uh, design actually is, I will link that in the card in the top right corner. So you can check out that video. Basically what you want to do in order to connect two parts that have a certain mechanical interlock or whatever. And you don't have the necessary hardware to connect both parts. What you do, for example here in Kira, just make sure that both parts are aligned. And I will align them in the along the x-axis. So let's say both parts are placed on the build plate. They are uh, spread apart. So let's say we 0x and this part is at 0, 0, 0. And now what we can do is can drag this part. This is the back plate for the over-engineered cable guides. And you just drag that into the other part. And it looks actually quite cool. And if you slice the part right now, there is no need for a... Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, so if you slice both parts, then you can see that they are joined together. And this for a lot of people might seem very, very obvious, but apparently some other people actually don't know that this is possible. So you can just push two STLs into one another and then they are basically combined. And this also works in the Prusa slicer. So we'll open it right now. So here we are in the Prusa slicer and you can also align these parts so let's say we want to align along the x-axis but just pick a value for example 50 this one also 50 then they are aligned because if you do zero zero then they will basically be uh, at the uh, edge right here which you don't want of course and then you can use the drag selection tool in order to move one part into another then they overlap and if you slice the parts they will be merged and then print as a single part if you have a mechanical connection for which you don't have the mounting hardware or the necessary tools to uh, to make uh, for example a tapped hole you can just merge the parts together in your uh, slicer of choice then slice the part and they will be connected thank you all for watching uh, next video will be uh, more uh, organized and Remember, just try to DIY.